Very cool. So uh, is that it for PlayStation VR then? No, because you promised. Oh yeah, you, that's right. That's you right. You promised me that I could talk about Monster of the Deep Final Fantasy 15. Unsurprising, I'm a massive Final Fantasy fan, and I'm really excited to get to show you a little bit more. I've got to play a bit of it, and I got to speak to Tabata San recently as well with PlayStation Access. So, so here it is. Here it is. Now before I talk about anything else, it is a standalone <coughs> game. So you don't need to own 15. It's not DLC. It's standalone game for PlayStation VR. So for anyone who's played the game, you'll recognize some of the locations, but I have been told there's some new ones as well, which is quite exciting because it's a beautiful world. Now, just like it is in 15, it feels quite similar to playing the fishing in 15, almost like it sounds daft, but what the VR you know, would be for the fishing in 15. Uh, different tackles, baits, different rods and lines, put them all together to create the right rods for catching different fish in different locations at do, different times. Do they include a VR fish cleaning mini game? <laughs> Could you imagine that would be, have you ever, I don't know, <laughs> it's, it's awful. We've Choc got Choc chocobos now, Carl. Look, <laughs> look, look, look. <laughs> yeah, so anyone who played Final Fantasy XV's uh, online beta for Comrades will recognize the character customization. It has incredible customization, best RPG hair I have seen in a long time. That's and important. A, I'm you'd, a character expect, you'd expect nothing less from Final Fantasy. I'm a character customization right? connoisseur, Rob. You know this. Yes, I The do. hair is beautiful. Uh, it also features uh, some of the characters you'll recognize from the game. You already saw Cindy. Now, when I spoke to Tabata-san, he told me that the, the whole team is in it. You know, Ignis, Noctis, Gladio, Prompto. Uh, and it actually takes place within the Final Fantasy 15 game. It takes place quite early on. You're basically going out, you meet the guys, and they're like, hey, why don't you come fishing with us? You can come and camp with us as well. Um, the character customization here is stunning. I think the biggest takeaway for this for me as a huge Final Fantasy fan is this VR game here put me into the world in a way that not even Final Fantasy XIV does. It really allows you, you're at the camp with the guys, you're able to steal food off Noctis' plate and he'd like try and bat you away. That was like the coolest thing in Final Fantasy XV, the camping. So to be in that is going to be like a massive wish fulfillment. It, it really was. Uh, it, it gave me something that fanfiction.net has never been able to. It really <laughs> put me into the world. Uh, but it gets better. I'm still allowed to talk about Final Fantasy XV. Oh There's more. There's more. There is. Uh, Final Fantasy XV episode Ignis. We know it's on the way. He is best boy. Do not at me. It's not a discussion. <laughs> um, but I'm really excited to be able to show uh, a new trailer for that with some new details. And I can also reveal that the guest composer is Yasunori Matsuda of Chrono Trigger, which everyone knows. Final Fantasy and music go hand in hand. So I guess we should just get going. Please enjoy the Final Fantasy XV Ignis trailer. Listen well. A king cannot lead by standing still. A king pushes onward always, accepting the consequences and never looking back. thing from here. Let's make for the altar. Yeah. Well, well, look who it is. What could one of his majesty's royal retainers be doing here of all places? Oh, bloody hell. Join me. I can secure us a way to the king and the oracle. Yeah. to live and love as you please. Oh, what good is a world that only ever lets you down? Why not end it all right here? I swore an oath to stand with Nott and keep him safe. Whatever it takes, I will protect him. Permit me to make a suggestion. 
Rather than follow this flotsam and float away to a watery grave, why not come with me? What do you say?